Kirsty Young and I currently represent the Poodle category for Groom Team England for the next World Championships in 2022. We've been asked to do you a few tips for competition grooming. My, my biggest tip I'll give is prep work. Prep work is the most important part of your groom. Without great prep work, you can't do a great groom. Just my opinion. Um, maintenance. Maintenance is your biggest thing, especially with my category. Obviously in Poodle, we have to grow a lot of coat. So everybody knows that I love to grow coat. Um, I'll grow my coats for months on end beforehand and I'll grow the really hairy dog. That's my own personal goal. I like to grow hair, go to a competition and then see what I can do in that time. Competition grooming, um, I really, really enjoy it. Um, I love the buzz of it. I love the relationships you make with people, uh, the friendships you make. And I love having that two and a half to two hours, 45 minutes, just totally zoned out and grooming my own dog. Um, it's just, it's like it's a different world and you get into your little zone and you get your scissors out and you just groom. And if you get placed, it's a massive bonus. But if you want to compete, you want to seriously compete, find yourself a really good dog. It's got to be good construction. It doesn't have to be a world winning, you know, championship show dog. Just a really nice, well constructed dog with a really good coat. And you can go miles with it. You've got to learn about that dog. Keep learning on that dog. So every time you compete with it, if you don't get placed, get your feedback, have a look, take pictures and scrutinise your own grooves. Take pictures and look at it and go, right, actually, I could go a bit more hair here. I need to take more hair off there. And then you can do it and you'll compete the next time with the same dog and you'll improve your groom. And each time improve every time. And then when you get there and you get your placement and you go, yeah, I'm, I'm really happy with that. As long as you are happy with your groom, it makes no difference whether you place or not. Coming from groom team, yes, obviously we, we've had to win to get here, but it's taken a long time to get here and learning from other people and competing. First few competitions I ever went to, I was unplaced. And I got my feedback and I went back and did it again. And I just kept going. So for me, dream big and then make it bigger. And then you'll get there and really, really, really enjoy it. Good luck.